Good morning. Uh, today we are going to see how to upload uh, customers in Oracle Cloud. This is okay. It is the object um, for that to run that uh, for, create, for uploading of uh, Oracle car Oracle customers. We have to go to Zeus building. This is one of the way to upload or update um, the contacts or anything like that. You want to update or insert. So you want to create new or uh, new customers or otherwise you want to update some information about the customers. Uh, we need uh, this type of uh, loading. Okay. So then you have to go to manage data import. Then click on this. Give the batch name. Then source is you have to see customer subjected by we are we are loading um, data from the CSV file. Then object is customer and consumer and save and close. Okay, it will create then it will create like uh, click on this. Will create batch ID, take this batch ID. So Oracle is provided uh, templates. So we have to replace with uh, here. Okay, then after replacing here, suppose you want to insert a new customer, you have to take a ID. Suppose you want to update information on the customer, of the customer, you have to go to take a U. Okay. So once it's loaded, uh, once it's done, you have to use this uh, like batch ID in this uh, batch ID interface. Okay. Is one of the requirement. Otherwise, it won't work. Okay. And after that. Uh, after that, and save, and save it first. Okay. Then, go to, like, go to tools. Then, you have to go to schedule programs. New schedule, new process. Then uh, I have to take load interface file for import. Then we have to import that use You have to use import uh, to grab here, taking some time, and it's slow. You have to use import trading community data in plus. You have to use this process. Then you have to upload new file. Use file, use this, and OK, and submit, 
after that you can go to again have to go to see was link then go to manage data import so that you have to use this okay then next next submit this is a process okay so uh, this is the using FPGA okay? file based data FPGA. Okay, so we can also load data using REST API. I will try to um, do it in next video. So this is the basic steps. First step is you have to create a batch, uh, batch import batches. After that, you have to go to already provided. Uh, you have to use that. Uh, batch ID here, then after that you have to zip the file, okay, and because we are using, because the uh, party identify CSV, because we are using CSV, comma separate value, and then <clears throat> after that, we have to run that process, okay, import, for import process, after that, we are going to go to billing, then manage data import and we have to go to and import here. This is the process. Okay. So if you have any doubts using FBDL or uh, custom import or update, updating the customer, uh, please write to me in comment section so that I can get back to you. Thank you.